Welcome back everyone, thanks for joining us. We're here at NRF 2019, here at the Hughes On booth here, and uh, talking again with Ryan Craver at Commerce Canal. Uh, he said something earlier that I really wanted to get a chance to go back and just get a little more insight into. So, Ryan, you said, uh, you made a comment about how you thought um, tracking customers in the store, sort of in-store customer analytics was a big, a big place that you thought was also a major trend for 2019. So, talk a little bit more about that. Absolutely, so um, several years ago when we started looking at the stores, we didn't have the technology at the time to figure out how many people converted in a store, what the heat maps were like in a store, where we needed to focus our labor efforts in a store, um, but we're here today and we can do all of that stuff. It's a very hot topic in today's NRF, mainly because Amazon Go has now come out and stated very clearly that there's going to be thousands of stores in which they're going to use their platform. Microsoft jumped the gun with Kroger and opened two stores in which they're doing something similar. So if you are a retailer in today's environment and you are not online as a store, and I'm not talking about your inventory online, I'm talking about managing the customer flow, understanding the customer flow, figuring out how you should resource your stores accordingly, you're just going to get passed by others. You need to understand who's coming in, how many's coming in, and whether they're converting or not. Well, thank you, Ryan. That's that's really insightful stuff. And I'll say we we absolutely agree with you. You know, on our side, we've got our Wi-Fi location analytics, and that's exactly what we're trying to help our customers do: figure out who's in the store, how long they're there, where they're going, how they're converting. Um, while they're in the store, are they price checking your, your products against somebody else's? All the sorts of things you want to know uh, to better understand and manage your store. Y you said something earlier as well, I'd maybe just give you a chance to talk a little bit about this as well. The fact that this kind of insight helps you on both the revenue generation side as well as on the uh, cost management side. Right, right. So you now have the majority of retailers seeing a positive lift in their online sales. Great, it's growing. On the in-store, you're seeing negative for the most part. Except for a few guys like Costco, you're seeing negative. So you need to optimize every single visit. And what I mean by that is, if you understand your traffic, you understand what they're looking at, what they're actually buying versus not buying, or what they're intrigued by, you have a better ability to sell more, and then secondly, resource it accordingly. So if I know in a large department store, that shoes is down 15% year over year in traffic, maybe I don't necessarily need as many resources as I did two weeks ago, or the year prior, whatever that comp period was. Or maybe I need to come up with a completely different incentive plan to turn them from a fixed hourly rate to a variable rate based on commission. So understanding what's happening in your store at the cash register is one thing, but understanding the actual customer and what's driving those conversions or where they're being driven is a much different, th much more different thing that you can then drive other projects, other initiatives off of. Awesome, well thank you very much. That's fantastic insight and again, the sort of thing you can learn if you stop by the Hughes booth here at NRF 2019. Come into the booth, come talk to one of our industry experts, talk to us. We'd love to hear your thoughts on this and love to talk more about what's driving retail trends in 2019.